Today, I'm gonna to show you how to make some deck cards. These are essential equipment if you wanna be doing any kind of mapping or tuning. Um, so I'm gonna show you how to make a set. Very simple, very easy, takes a few minutes. You'd have seen those in action in some of my videos. So today I'm gonna to show you how to make some. Right, so what we need for making the deck hands, set of air defenders. Um, I use the Peltor Optime 3s, which give a good amount of um, noise isolation as well. We need about three meters of hardwood pipe. For this I use a, it's a, a compressor hose. Now, I think that's 12 and a half mil internal diameter. Bit of copper pipe. Length of that. Your local plumber will have loads of this spare. If not, you can buy long lengths of that from local B&Q or hardware store. Tools wise, you need a whole cutting bit, a drill, silicon lube, and a heat gun. I'll show you what to do with it. Okay, the first job that we need to do is drill a hole in the bottom of the ear defenders uh, for the pipe to go into. So that's what I'll do now. Let's take these apart. I'll just pop out one of the ear pieces and the rubber inside. Okay, so we need to drill a hole in the bottom part of one of the air pieces. So, drill. Pop that in the vise. Okay, so we've got the earpiece in the vise. Just gonna drill a little hole. Big enough yet. Okay, that will probably do it. Nearly, not quite. blade and clean up the edges. Right, as you can see now, the end of the hose is just able to get through hole in the air defenders. Nice snug fit. We'll just take it in there a little bit. 
perfect. Let's put the ear defenders back together. Don't need all the foam from the inside. The idea is you want to hear what's going on. Okay, that's one half of that done. Right, on the other end of the hose, we want to get a bit of copper pipe into the end of that so that we can then bolt that onto the manifold or any other part of the engine that we're wanting to listen. So a bit of copper pipe, that needs to go in there. Quite a tight fit, hence why we need the heat gun. All right, so with the heat gun, let's just gently warm this up. Then with a bit of silicon spray on the end of the copper pipe, we should be able to push that into there we go it's gone in about an uh, inch and a half lovely this end we want to flatten this and make it so that we can bolt it to a part of the inlet manifold so just handy that I've got a vise here Nice and flat. Let's drill a hole in that. Alright, so we've got a 8mm drill bit. So we've now got an 8mm hole on the end, we could just use it like that, but I don't like to completely take bolts out when I'm affixing these to the engine, so I'm just going to slot down the end here. So there we have it, that's the end, I'll just clean that up a bit, nicely secured inside the pipe, we don't need a jubilee clip in that, once that cools down that's not going anywhere. Right, on the other end, we just need to get the rest of the headphones on there. So they just clip into place. Lovely. So that's the finished article. Absolutely imperative if you're gonna be doing any kind of tuning. So there we are, done. If I put the microphone in there. I've got a few sets of these already, so these aren't needed by me. So if you want them, put a comment down below and we'll sort out how we can get them to you. So thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Thank you.